Hey, what's going on? It's Charlie here with Plug One Two. It's been a while. Um, I'm going to do a recap of the fights between the post-fight fight uh, between uh, Conor McGregor's team and Habib Nurmagomedov's team. I personally feel a lot of this is based out of passive aggressiveness, right? Like Khabib or Habib tried to play it really cool during the press conferences and, and the uh, media appearances where Conor would try to get underneath his skin. And what I noticed with Habib, he would just kind of like brush it off and pretend it didn't affect him. But after winning against the fight, which I understand if you're vitriolic because it is a combat sport, right? You're punching each other in the face and, and you're trying to break someone's joint, right? You're trying to attempt all these submissions. But, you know, at, at the end of the fight, after you beat someone convincingly, you really should just walk away and be like, you know what, that's done, it's a wrap. Uh, that's where I wanna give Conor McGregor credit because with him, after a, a loss or a win, he'll congratulate the opponent and say like, hey man, that's a good fight. You've seen that with Nick Diaz. You've seen that with most of his opponents that he tries to trash, even in boxing with Floyd Mayweather. He, he was you know, in good spirits at the same time. Now, in regards to uh, Habib Nur Nurmagomedov jumping off the fence, he didn't need to do that. His, uh, his team, I, I do believe we counted three people, and it's also reported that three people are arrested, taking cheap shots at Conor McGregor. You don't need to do that. It's, it, it, it's, it's complete uh, insecurity and a lack of understanding of context. That was done. It's a wrap. You defeated the opponent, physically and mentally. But now what happened was you made Conor McGregor uh, look like a victim. And the fight wasn't even factored anymore. The brilliance of round three, where Habib and Conor start exchanging and throwing blows. Uh, you know, Habib with the ability just to control someone. Just to almost maim someone and, and control the legs with his own legs when he's on top. You know, all of that proficient technique is, is gone. 